Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited because I'm sharing my day one opening of my advent calendar from my friend Alice. And I opened it already as you can see, but I left it in the box because I wanted to show you guys how she shipped it to me and then we can kind of unpack it together. And I even left the pocket letters unopened because I wanted like a first reaction, so a real first reaction. Um, so I'm assuming that these are the pocket letters here. If you don't know what an advent calendar pocket letter is, it's just for you um, did the same thing as you would with a normal pocket letter, but you make sure that you have at least 25 of the little pockets and you include something for your swap buddy to open each day. So I sent Alice one, she sent me this one in return. If you haven't seen um, the one that I sent Alice, I do have a video for that over on my channel, so be sure to go and check that out. But let's go ahead and get into it, so I'm so excited. So I thought this was so cute what she did here. She took some crepe paper and just like, um, I almost said chopped it up. That was, that was gonna be a weird word. Like shredded it up. Um, so I thought that was so, so cute. And then, so like I said, I'm pretty sure these are the pocket letters. So we'll open those up together here in just a second. But as you can see, anything that wouldn't fit into a normal pocket, she went ahead and she wrapped it and then she put a number on it. So that'll tell me what day to open what present. So like here's 19. All right, so here is today's gift that will open here in just a second. Again, love this. Look at how cute this is, you guys. You guys are gonna have to steal her idea. This is adorable. I am for sure gonna keep this and reuse it. So cute. I'm gonna go ahead and put the rest of the presents actually back down in here just to kind of keep them um, all in one place. But I just wanted to show you guys each one. Oh my gosh, she gave me some big stuff. I am always so terrified when I do swaps that my partner did so much better than I did. So I hope that I was fair to you, Alice. Um, I guess we'll find out when I'm opening them, but so excited to start. All right, let's go ahead and let's get into these pocket letters. So this is really cute. You can see here she did a little embellishment and then she's got these 3D um, trees. Those are really cute. And then she's just got my name to and from. So let's open these up. I'm so excited. Okay. So I love the way she did it. She did it like accordion style. So they're all connected to one another. So I love this. She put, oh, how sweet. Okay, I'll look at that here in a second when we start opening. But she made a, she made a little tassel here. I hope that that's picking up. And it's got a little peppermint embellishment there. How cute, very pretty. Love that. Okay, so that's hanging off the side there. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at the first, um, let's see, one, two, that is so fun. She just put them all over the place. That is so cute. Okay, so here's one. Let me see if I can find two. Where? Oh, oh my gosh, I'm blind. Two is here, so one, two. I'm just showing you guys in case you still don't completely understand what this is. And then there's three, four, five. Where 
are you? Six. There we go. Oh, this is so cute. Six. Be good for goodness sake. Aw. Six. And then we're at seven. Where are you? Seven. You guys at home probably see it, and I don't, and I'm, like, completely blind. Where in the world is seven? Oh, my gosh. Come on, Soph. You got this. Oh, my gosh. Okay. I'm not completely crazy. That little ribbon was over. Okay, so seven. And then here is eight. It's like when you're looking at a crossword puzzle and it's right in front of you, but you're trying so hard that you miss the obvious. This is so cute. Look at this little ice skate. It's got flowers and a um, candy cane coming out of it. That's so cute. I love that. So this is eight. Where is nine? There it is. Nine's right here. I love this too. That is so cute. And then ten. It's right here. And eleven. Love that die cut she used. Twelve. Thirteen. 14, 15, cute little snowflakes there, 15, 16, and again, loving this, love the way she did the little lace over the top of it, 17, Christmas bells, 18 right here, 19 with a cute little house, um, 20, these are so cute, look at these mittens and they're in pastel colors, it's like a little um, mitten banner, 20, 21, 22, and it looks like maybe she Mod Podge that, so I love that. Very cute. Um, 23 is here, Noel. And then 24, where are you? 24. Oh, thanks for my face. Love this. 24 is a little shaker. And then, ooh, I really like that. That's super cute. And then 25. So that is so fun. I love this. Special delivery, 25. So I had a few things that fit into the back. And Alice was like, I don't, nothing fit in the back of mine. When I, I emailed her and I was like, hey, I'm just warning you, I had to wrap a lot of it because hardly any of it would fit into the back. And she was like, well, I wrapped all of it because none of mine. And I was like, okay, well, whew, like that makes me feel better. Um, some of this stuff probably had no business with me sticking it down back behind it, but I made it. Like I squished it in there and it may have popped a few times. But anyways, loving these shaker pockets. Check out these shakers. This one's snowflakes, so cute. And then I already showed you this shaker. And then there's this shaker right here. It looks like Alice probably found the same little sequins that I found at Tuesday morning. I was so excited to find these. I regretted not buying more than one. And then when I went back, they were completely gone. So um, I love that she was able to find them. Okay, so I'm so excited because hers doesn't have anything stuck in the back. I can actually stick this up on my wall this month and I can just look at every day and just show you guys each day. But today we are focusing on number one, which is right here. It says Mary, it's got some pretty poinsettias. These are very pretty stickers. They're um, like cardstock stickers. Yeah, that's what they look like. So really, really cute. It looks like she stuck something in just this one. It says icicle ornament. This is so cute. This will look so pretty on my tree. I love this. Thank you, Alice. So cute. All right. So I'm so excited. Let's go ahead and open up present number one. I will stick this on my wall. Okay, so here is present number one. I wonder if I can try, you guys know me, I'm a salvager. So I'm gonna salvage this cute little banner thing that she used, very cute. I'll definitely try to salvage the paper as well. So I have a grandma that she she likes to reuse like everything. So when she's opening her presents, it takes her like five minutes to open her, oops, open her presents because she literally like she will sit there and she will fold the paper back. Like she'll have the present open but she'll like be sitting there folding the paper back and my dad is like, mom, just open the present. So I'm gonna be my grandma for this. So, all right. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. Okay, so I was able, I was able to like use that or not use that. I was able to get that off pretty cleanly. So yay, I will save that as well. This is too cute. It looks like it came from Pier 1, which here in my town, we do have a Pier 1. It's kind of in a totally random spot in our town, so I never go to it, but we do have a Pier 1. I love it. I love Pier 1 stuff. I just never think to go there, so so cute. It says the North Pole Santa Claus, December 25th. The stamp is actually a different piece than the fabric. 
Christmas Express or Christmas Express mail 25th of December this is too adorable I really love this oh how adorable and then it's got a little button and this little thing here you just kind of fasten it that way oh I didn't think there'd actually be anything inside so it looks like let's see yeah, she wrote me a little note. I think this little piece stays in there. Yeah, this is so cute. I love it. All right, so I'll read her little note here in a second. This is so adorable. I love this, Alice. Thank you so much. This is so cute. This was a fun day one. Oh, Merry Christmas to you too, Alice. And you absolutely did it right. You probably did it better than I did. I feel like I always say that. Like, she always does such a great job. So I'm so excited. I'm sitting here trying to remember what I put in her day one and I cannot remember. It honestly, like I started out being pretty like strategic with like what she opens up on certain days. And then it got to a point where I was just having to put things in different numbers because I had a bunch of just random stuff picked for random numbers. So I can't exactly remember what I put in her day one. But anyways, um, I hope she likes it too. I hope you like it as well, Alice. I know you'll watch this video. So I'm so excited. This is gonna be so fun this month. Love, love, love this. And now I'm gonna have to go to Pier 1 Imports. So, all right, you guys, stay tuned for my video tomorrow of my opening up on day two. I'm also gonna really be trying to post more Christmas DIYs. I actually have a plan coming up. I bought the stuff for it to make little um, Christmas bulb ornaments that look like Ray Dunn. So if you're interested in that, let me know below that you're looking forward to that. I'd like to know. Um, and yeah, so that's going to be really fun. That's, that's kind of next on my list to film. So thank you guys so much for sticking with me till the end. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.